Apple support. Para español, oprima nueve. Call the recorded and transcribed for evaluation to train personnel and approve contact center technologies. To securely verify your identity, I'd like to send a consent notification to your Apple devices. Do I have your permission to do that? Yes. Okay, I've sent the message. If you're calling about charges on your account, say billing. Otherwise, what Apple product or service are you calling about? iPad Pro and iPhone? Was that iPad Pro? Yes or no? Yes. In a few words, what's going on with the iPad? Um, uh, stolen Apple ID. <coughs> It sounds like you're calling about an issue with your Apple account. <coughs> Is that right? Yes. Thanks. By the way, for privacy reasons, Apple support can't reset your password. But you can reset it and manage your Apple account yourself on our website. If you like, before transferring you, I can send you the link. Standard message rates may apply. Would you like me to send the message? Yes. Sorry. I hope we can do the survey another time. Apple's warranty coverage is in addition to your rights provided by consumer law. Warranty, privacy policy, and privacy rights information are available at apple.com slash legal. I'll transfer you now. Remember that our advisors are here to help. Please treat them with kindness. There's currently an extended wait time to speak with an Apple advisor. For help online now. Thank you for calling Apple. This is John. Can I tell your name? Hi, uh, my name is Fu Min Ting Nguyen. Can I report my Apple has a problem? And I got dropped an Apple a device by Chi Tao Nguyen. She robbed my dad's. Uh, Uh, iPhone, uh, my my iPhone, but I let my dad use, and she robbed my dad's iPhone, and she hacked my dad's Facebook, and she hacked my niece's Facebook, and she used my niece's um, e email to make an Apple ID, and then she hacked my Facebook, my niece's uh, Facebook, and my niece thought I hacked her Facebook, but I did not hack, and she framed on me, uh, and her name is Tracy Tao Nguyen. She is uh, living in Westminster, California. Uh, 14132 Summer Wood Drive, Westminster, California, 92683. And last time, Apple store a uh, screen share with me, uh, Apple Apple Care screen screen share with me, and caught that the, my dad's phone um, is in her hand. That was my original phone, and I lent to my dad, and my dad passed away, so she stole my dad's Apple ID, uh, Apple phone, and she hacked my dad's Facebook, and she hacked my niece's Facebook. And she also um, have uh, and I, and my secondary Apple ID is in the um, in, on the phone, and I could not do anything without Apple ID because she has the phone, and and then she used my um my she deleted my my video from my iPad using um something with my iPad, and she locked my iPad so I cannot do anything right now, my iPad iPad Pro and um and then uh, she changed uh, my Apple ID um from my iPad to her. Apple ID and using my that my niece uh, e email to make her Apple ID and my niece was innocent. My niece didn't do anything like that. Or um I don't know who, um my um some somehow my 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 Apple ID was changed to another uh, another Apple ID and um and then I went to Apple Store and I said what happened to my iPad Pro and they saw there's a there's an Apple ID that is not mine and it's not my niece uh, Apple ID. So they found out, oh, now you have to do something with this. You have to ask your niece to give you the password to the Apple ID. But my niece that didn't do anything to my iPad and somebody did something to my iPad. I don't know what happened, uh, why um, somebody's um, Apple ID was on my uh, iPad Pro and I don't know what happened. 
and I got a crack on my uh, iPad. I did not do it. Somebody did crack my uh, iPad. Um, something that means somebody touched my iPad uh, or something that cracked my iPad, and I did not do it. Okay. Well, um, yeah, that's definitely a lot there. But you are in the right place, and we can um, see what we can do about getting you access to your account. Yeah. Now, um, do you have? What are the? Uh, what is your Apple ID? Uh, my, and what Apple devices do you have right now? Uh, my Apple ID is uh, Miss Secondary nineteen ninety three at gmail dot com. But there was uh, somebody changed uh, my Apple ID to another Apple ID that I could not sign into my iPad. And last about a couple of three weeks, I don't see, I see my iPad was normal. And now when I see back, it has a crack on my iPad and somebody touched or did something with my iPad that I don't know. If somebody touched my iPad and did something again, because last time I already checked in, talk, check, I went to Apple Store directed by Apple Care from the phone to tell me to go, go to Apple Store and Apple Store tell me to get a password to get to get that but then something happened again and then i don't know what happened to my my iPad pro and my niece said oh did you hack my facebook i said no i did not hack your facebook somebody used my ipad uh, with your account to hack your facebook i did not do it and my niece thought it was me and i have to prove to my niece i did not hack her facebook but tracy tong Wen hacked her facebook because when, last time uh, when i tried to open the um, the, the ipad i saw uh, tracy Nguyen account um, in there with my with my niece account and she did something with my niece um, so i said oh um my i told my niece lena Nguyen, oh your 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 facebook got hacked by tracy Nguyen, and she didn't believe and she and she thought i did it but i didn't i didn't do it because i discovered tracy tao Nguyen hacked my niece lena Nguyen facebook and my niece thought i hacked her facebook and i, I never hacked her facebook okay yeah that yeah um, we're gonna do what we can to get. Um, get can I report there. to a fraud department of Apple Store because she stole my uh, Apple um, ID, and Apple so, uh, Apple uh, Apple um, Apple iPhone, um, and then it's in her hand. It's in, in her house right now, uh, because last time I screen share with Apple uh, Apple Store, Apple uh, screen scare. Uh, I drove to her house nearby, and then uh, I um, the Apple Store helped me to use to find my app. Uh, to locate my phone and we locate that her, the phone is in her hand and in her house and then we locate the address so we know that, that it's in her house and then um and then apple store told me to call law, law enforcement to to get back because um in that phone that has my dad's facebook that i programmed for my dad's facebook before and then the secondary facebook she hacked the secondary facebook uh, she tried to hack the the first facebook she yanked out my my dad's first facebook that i i programmed for him and then she used a secondary um, Facebook for my dad, and my dad used it, and now she hacked another sec a secondary Facebook of my dad too. And I report to Mark Zuckerberg, the CEO, that uh, Tracy Tawin hacked my niece's Facebook and hacked my dad's fa secondary Facebook and uh, robbed my um, my I my iPhone, Apple ID, Apple device. I report on Facebook uh, of Mark Zuckerberg, but um, I did not. I don't. I did not have email or contact with Mark Zuckerberg. But I Google um, um for on Facebook um, with Mark Zuckerberg name, and I I message. I just um put a message there, and I report that Tracy Tangwin is a Facebook hacker. Okay. And I gave I gave Mark Zuckerberg her name, her phone number, her email, her address, her work address too. And she's changed your passwords. Um, I don't know what happened now. Um, that she changed for the. I have the secondary Apple ID for my dad's um phone and my dad's uh, I program for my dad, and now I could not do something with that Apple ID because she did something with that Apple ID or, it might be still in the phone but um on that phone and then that's why I couldn't do something with the Apple ID so I I, I have a difficulty. Uh, retrieve back my my Apple ID that I programmed for my dad because at that Apple ID I can retrieve back the videos and Tracy Tong when she deleted my video from my iPad uh, when I recorded my dad's um, uh, dying last breath um, for evidence uh, and I called the police on that day and I saw her mom um, Linda Nguyen um, lock my dad um, mouth when he tried to open uh, for his last breath and I told her don't don't touch my dad, and she touched my dad, and my dad later passed away. And then um, when I called the police to access the uh, the death, 
uh, body and then um, um, she, Lin, Linda Nguyen and Tracy Nguyen kicked the police out to access my dad's uh, corpse uh, to see, uh, to, to know what happened to my dad's death. And then I have the witness video and she deleted my video or something. I don't know, uh, my brother did not delete that video. And, and my niece did not delete that video and only Tracy can access my Facebook, uh, my, my, my iPad too. Or she deleted something, I don't know what happened to my uh, video that day. And only Tracy, uh, I witnessed Tracy delete my, uh, my video of my dad before uh, in front of my face. And I think she deleted my dad's uh, video of, of, of the dying last breath. And uh, that's the evidence to, to court her mom was, um, her mom, uh, Linda Nguyen, was filed a restraining order to stay away from my house. And her mom came to my dad's uh, um, um, before my dad's dying last breath. And she came and I told her that you cannot come. If you come, I call the police. And when I called Westminster Police, Tracy Tao Nguyen brainwashed, uh, persuaded the police to talk bad thing about me. And then the police tackled me and I was pregnant. And I was uh, like 18 days to have a baby born and then I was pregnant. And the police tackled me because um, Tracy Tao Nguyen brainwashed the police and the police listened to her and then the police tackled me and then I report uh, the police supervisor and the supervisor got that police into trouble and that, his name is Howard Lin, the American um, brand new police officer got brainwashed by Tracy Tao Nguyen and now she did something with my iPad and I don't know how, what to do with my iPad because it's locked because last time uh, because last time um, I locked, I, I changed my passcode from my iPad and then how, somehow now um, I could not uh, sign, with, sign with, with my passcode but something yeah. did something with my iPad and then when I open it I will use my passcode and my, my passcode got locked, locked uh, got, um, got unlocked and then somebody did something to my iPad and then I saw an Apple ID uh, in there and that, that, that was not mine and I don't know who changed my my iPad passcode when I did not change it and my niece did not touch it, my brother did not touch it. So somebody touched my iPad and did something to my iPad and I, I don't know what happened. But only me know the passcode of my pass, my my uh, iPad when I discovered Tracy Tangwin hack. My niece Facebook and used my my uh, my iPad, uh, touched my iPad before. And now my iPad is locked, I cannot do anything. Um, um, so I don't know what to do. Uh, do I? Call, uh, can I pr uh, report the fraud department from Apple Store and the police department too of Apple uh, Apple Police? Uh, do Apple Police have Apple Police uh, for to to call these um, uh, these, these robbers that that do something with my uh, iPad, my iPhone too? Is there a fraud department so I can report to? Uh, we don't have a department that you can speak to right here, but uh, we do have ways that you can. Go ahead and submit the feedback there. Yeah, and, and then I file, 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 file restraining orders against Tracy Tangwin, and she don't stay away, and she still do something with my my Apple device. Apple. You already reported her too, right? Huh? You've already reported her. Um, I just um, I went to the police station in Westminster. Does your niece have access to your accounts too? Huh? Or just Tracy. Does your niece have access to your accounts too, or just Tracy? Um, no, um, my, my niece don't know my account, um, but, um, she okay. used, she used the iPad to put her, uh, put my niece, she email in there, and my niece email, I helped my niece to recover her email password, and she recovered her email, and then, uh, she recovered her email so she can recover her, her Facebook, and then she thought I, I, she thought I hacked her Facebook, but actually Tracy Tao Nguyen hacked her Facebook, and my name is Fu Min Ting Nguyen. And then I I helped my niece uh, recover her her Facebook. I told, oh niece, your 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 Facebook got hacked by Tracy Tao Nguyen. But my niece thought it was me, and I so I did not hack. I found out that she hacked your Facebook. I told you, and and I have to pr prove to my niece that I am I'm innocent about his, her Facebook hack. And she used my Apple uh, my 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 Apple uh, my Apple um iPad Pro that I bought, um, and then they shipped to my house two or three years ago. And then I lend my, my brother used the to use the the iPad, and I don't know why my Apple ID was changed to uh, um, an Apple ID of another person. It could be an Apple ID of my niece or an Apple ID of my um, my um, of Tracy Tangwen. But my niece um, um, don't have that Apple ID anymore because she might have forgotten her uh, password of that Apple ID or something. 
and then I don't know um I don't know what happened between me my niece and my brother and Tracy Tong when uh, she did something to my niece's account and I'm innocent okay. and then um my uh, my Apple my Apple uh, iMac um 27 inch the largest um invention of the iPad iMac before uh, I had my Apple ID and then I let my niece borrow it and she used it and then somebody changed to her Apple another and put an Apple ID when I just lent my niece um but I don't know why and, and then they crack into my um somebody did something with my I, iMac and I told my niece you have you have to return me the iMac because my, the iMac was registered under my Apple ID and somebody changed to another Apple ID and then um when I look at the the product that I own from Apple Store, the iMac uh, 27 inch uh, was not listed on my account anymore, and because say somebody changed uh, the Apple ID, uh, and now I, I don't know who who claimed that they own my uh, my 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 iMac 27 Apple ID because I don't have my app. They changed my Apple ID to another person Apple ID. Uh, so when I look at all the product I have from the Apple Store. Uh, like uh, AirPod, iPhone, iPad, a MacBook Pro, MacBook Pro, MacBook um, Air, and uh, the new iMac. But then the iMac 27, the largest, the larger than the iMac 20, 24, um, was not listed on my account anymore because somebody changed their um, their um, the Apple ID. And when I took my Apple uh, Mac to Apple Store, and they say, oh. Uh, you have, and then they did something to my Apple. Uh, they they delete out somebody's Apple ID before, and they put in mine, and then something happened to my Apple uh, 27 inch. Uh, I could not do anything right now too. So now I have the Apple ID, uh, the Apple iMac 27 inch, and the Apple i uh, the Apple iPad Pro 11 is disabled, and the two cannot be used anymore. I don't know what to do right now. Do I bring those back to Apple Store and to help to get help with something? Yeah, definitely. And now, um, so somebody did something to my Apple ID um, from I, the iMac, the largest invention of iMac ever, but they don't have it anymore. The twenty-seven inch to 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 use for editing the the movies, uh, movie the uh, movies um movies project. And um, I bring to the Apple Store, and Apple Store changed to my Apple ID back. But when it changed back, something wrong, and then I couldn't do anything. So, so they don't know what happened to my app. So now I have two things disabled. Okay, so both Apple IDs are disabled. Um, no, the iPad Pro is changed to another person's Apple ID, and the iMac was changed back to my Apple ID. But when I changed back, it still doesn't list it as my as my no my um. As I claim, it was mine, uh, but it's not listed on the on the account that I have for for my Apple ID, uh, and then oh, something is wrong. So I don't know what happened. Tracy, take it off. Um, the Apple Store uh, department in the store uh, tried to use um, to delete something in there and then put my Apple ID back, but maybe that is illegal or something. Now I cannot use the Apple iMac and I, 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 iPad Pro 11. Both are disabled. I cannot do anything with that. Okay, can you uh, can you go ahead and hold on the line for me? Let me see yeah. if I can get hold of the client. Yeah. And then we'll, uh, we'll see what we can uh, do. Do you have a fraud department or a stolen um, Apple uh, device department so I can report? Uh, unfortunately, we don't have a, a, a department I can transfer you to on that. But hmm. let me uh, let me go ahead and check. Um, can you hold on for me for, for two or three minutes? Yeah. Okay, thank you.
Có gì ăn không vậy ta? 
có gì ăn không? đang nướng gà đó, đang nướng đó, cánh gà đó đang nướng gà hả? cánh gà chứ không phải là con gà ồ đang nướng cánh gà chín chưa? chưa 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 bắt lửa à hai giờ Yes. submit your information for the fraud and, and compromised account. Yeah. Um, now, have you reset your password yet? Um, uh, I, uh, somebody did something with the passcode. I don't know if she, okay. she did it and then uh, she put it to the, um, to the app ID, uh, app ID and that is uh, not an app ID that I don't know. Um, and then, um, and then because last couple um, days, about two weeks ago, I went to Apple store and i used my passcode to talk to but then something was disabled again and then i don't know what happened i don't know what to do i have to report to fraud department you just email me right yes i did uh so how do i report to fraud department um uh, i'm gonna make you a reservation now what was the closest apple store you had uh in costa mesa Oh, okay. All right. Give me one second here. I'm going to pull up the time. Yeah. Now, do you, uh, what time do you have available to go? Any time right now. Uh, right now, it's, uh, right now it's three, three, three fifty. I can go any time right now. From here, from the, from now to the, there is only 20 minutes driving. Okay. All right. Um, let me go ahead and see what I can pull up. Okay. Give me one minute. And then uh, I I have to ask about my iPad Pro, and then I have to ask about my my iMac 27 inch. Uh, got disabled too. So both of these are something wrong and then I could not do anything right now. So and yeah, I need my I need I need I'll, my Apple to, to to work in as an emergency. Yeah Yeah, I'll have to let me make a note of both of those for the case here. So yeah. that when you break them in, they'll understand. Okay? So yeah me, uh, One second here, I'm gonna get it. Um, can you report to Apple store at the Costa Mesa too? Because when I come there, I don't have to tell them Everything I tell you again because you can type and tell them so because then right. I will yeah yeah so I can do that and the thing about it is is um, they don't have any more appointments left for today okay so their earliest appointment is gonna be for tomorrow at two twenty five is that okay two twenty five um no uh can I can it be the evening or um or, what time do you, what time is the the Apple store uh, open um the Apple they open at 11 from 11 to 7 11 to 7 tomorrow yes uh can i come at 11 uh they don't have any appointments for 11 so you could do a walk-in but you'll have to wait no i like appointments okay so i can do an appointment for any time after 225 i have 225 all the way to 605 uh, uh, can I have a, a two, uh, what, what, two, what? 225? Uh, two, uh, and then, um, one is for iPad Pro and one is for iMac. Okay, uh, that's fine. I'm gonna, uh, make a note for both of them. Yeah. So, 225 tomorrow? Yes, 225 tomorrow. Okay. Now, do you want a text, do you want a text message confirmation sent to your cell phone? Yes. Right, yes. Go yeah. And what number do you want your confirmation to go to? Uh, three seven one four three nine zero six six three two. All right. Perfect. All right. I was able to get that locked in. Yeah. So you're all good to go for tomorrow at two twenty five. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. Bye. All right. Bye.